Guys, have you ever thought about how many times you may have slept with your significant other? You shouldn't know the answer, so let me just start there, all right? If you do, that's terrifying. And we'd like you to leave. Yeah, if you're sitting here, you're like, oh, finally, somebody has... It's 926. <laughs> There's the exits. What I'm saying, I'm saying as a concept, it is reasonable to assume if you've been with somebody three years, you have a healthy thing going on, you may have slept together a few hundred times, right? Right. Now, I want you to think about how many times your dad <laughs> has finished inside of your mom. <laughs> So many times. <laughs> Tom, why would you say that? <laughs> well, basically, I think all of our moms are a bunch of cum dumpsters, you know, but <laughs> your mom more than my mom. Now, <laughs> ugh, I know, it's a tough image to get out of your head once I've planted it, right? You're like, God damn it, my mom's dripping? Probably, yeah. <laughs> Soaking wet. Look, <laughs> your mom has done some nasty shit. Let's talk about it. <laughs> she really has. And uh, look, I'm here to defend her, all right? It is not her fault. It's your dad's fault, for sure. Your dad, with all due respect, is kind of a piece of shit. A little bit. And if you're like, not my dad, he's good. Yeah, to you. He's not always like that to your mom. If they've been together three decades, you don't think he says some off-colored shit every now and then? Of course he does. They're laying in bed, your dad's tossing and turning, he can't sleep. And your poor mother, is everything all right, dear? It's fine. Was supper good? Yeah, shut up. I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> can I do anything to help? Yeah, you can lick my balls, all right? <laughs> and you want to know something? Your poor mother, she does it, all right? She... <laughs> because she's a ball hog, so your mom gets down there. And she goes, I like my life. <laughs> <That's it. laughs> oh, your mom. Now, your grandma. Think about some of the things that she's done. On the railroad tracks or wherever she used to fuck around. <laughs> El Paso, I don't know. Uh, you're like, why are you saying this stuff, Tom? Because I'm having fun. <laughs> because I enjoy upsetting people. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it says about me psychologically, but there is, I don't know, there's like a, a marching band inside of me right now going, good job, good job. <laughs> yeah, because internally I picture somebody out there going like, I was having fun <laughs> until he talked about my slut mom. <laughs> and it makes me happy, I don't know.